okay so addition we have completed we have seen the horizontal addition vertical addition addition with carry and addition without carry so line addition you have already seen in the first standard itself so you don't need to uh, take it down again and here so regarding the addition we have seen the lots of exercise on a different method okay different types of questions we have seen isn't it okay so next we are going to see about the subtraction sub subtraction so the addition is used to add the total number of anything total number of anything for example if your brother having a five chocolates and you having a five chocolates how many chocolates have your total you have the addition means nothing but so like counting the total number counting the total number okay so in is in the subtraction means we have we, we are going to see the balance we are going to see the balance you doesn't you never hear the word balance okay in a subtraction yes but the subtraction is used to find out the balance so what is meant by balance for example you and your brother your brother having a five chocolates okay for in a, in a five chocolate you borrowed uh, chocolates from your brother three okay your brother having a brother how many chocolates he, he have five chocolates you borrowed for example your name is akash akash borrowed three chocolates now how many chocolates for example see here so there are five chocolates are given akash got three chocolates one Two and three. So the three chocolate was given to the Akash. So balance remaining. So remaining how many chocolates will be in with to your brother? Only your two chocolates will be the brother. Okay, you will have the two chocolates will be there in a brother's hands. So this is what a balance or a remaining. This is what a balance or remaining. For example, you have a ten balls. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. You have a ten balls here. Okay, so in the ten balls, there are a three friends: friend A, friend B, and friend C. So there are a three friends. Three. friends friend a friend b and friend c there are three friends okay how many balls i have 10 balls there are 10 balls so two balls were given to the friend a and four balls is given to the friend b 1 2 3 4 one ball is given to the friend c so how many balls will be the remaining and how many balls will be the a uh, balance only the three balls will be the balance so three will be the answer so this is what of to finding out the balance we need to perform the calculation subtraction okay so now we have <clears throat> i told you that there are some number of things is here instead of things if suppose i'm giving the number means how you are going to perform the subtraction we'll see that okay so 5 so addition we are going we will represent the symbol in a plus in that subtraction the sir symbol is minus 5 minus 3 5 minus 3 so on the basic level you already studied the subtraction how will you studied 1 2 3 4 5 so 5 so five dashes here how many numbers here 1 2 3 so balance will be the 2 so you will study this type of subtraction in your first standard syllabus okay so now you are grown up children so you have to be you don't need to put stra, sticks and stra, and uh, then you are going to strike it out don't need such a kind okay so is listen here so leave a five finger leave a five finger so how many numbers are here three number are here so you have to cut the three numbers and two is a balance this is the one type okay 
so now you more grown up isn't it so how you are going to find it out mean see here 5 from 5 to 3 you need a backward counting how will you backward 4 3 so you got a 2 as answer so this is the matured guy you will do the subtraction like this okay so you are a matured guys you are going to perform the subtraction like on a backward counting so next problem 6 minus 3 so how are you going to perform the subtraction using a backward counting 6 from 6 to 3 you need a backward counting and leave the finger 5 4 3 stop at 3 because a 3 is here it's 3 so how many numbers we have given 3 numbers are given here ok so next <coughs> some more bigger 9 minus 4 so you are going to perform the backward color uh, counting from 9 to 4 from 9 to 4 so half backward 9 8 7 6 5 4 so why I've stopped up to 4 because the number is 4 here let's we do one more time 8 7 6 5 4 why I've stopped up to 4 because the 4 is here how many fingers I have given here 5 fingers so 5 is any answer ok let's do one a few more sums here 7 minus 2 so from 7 to 2 you have to leave a back you have to perform the backward counting 6 5 4 3 and 2 so how many fingers I have given here yes 5 fingers so 5 is the answer next 8 minus 2 from 8 to 2 you have to uh, perform the backward counting 7 6 5 4 3 2 so how many fingers I have given yes 6 fingers why I have stopped up to 2 because this is a, this is a 2 is given here so we have to stop it up to 2 so this is how the subtraction the matured guy will work out ok because you are now grown up children you don't need to put a <clears throat> lines and strike it or don't do that such kind of things okay. ok so we have seen the only the single digit subtraction ok now we are going to see about the double digit subtraction for example 27 minus 15 ok so see here every time the so 1's column and it's a 10's column so 7 minus 5 same thing backward counting 6 5 2 next 2 1 only one finger so 12 12 is the answer so this is how to you are going to perform the subtraction in case of 0 in case of 0 any number that you are going to subtract with the 0 the number will be the answer for example see here 20 minus 15 so in this case how you are going to perform the answer means I told you already 0 minus 5 means 5 then 2 minus 1 means 1 is this answer no this is a wrong answer if the number comes as a single digit for example 5 minus 0 0 minus 3 2 minus 0 in this case means you are going to write the number alone in case if it comes like this 20 minus 15 so you have to check whether the number is next to 0 yes the number having next to 0 2 is a number so we are going to borrow only 1 <coughs> this is 0 already here if I put one number next to this then the 2 will become a 1 and it will become a 10 because it having a 2 number. Now number 2 means there are 2 ones are here, isn't it? So I have given only one, one, one ones here. And remaining 1 1 will be here. So 10 minus 5. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. So 5 is the answer. 1 minus 1, 0. In the subtraction, same number means the answer will be the 0. 0 minus 2, 2. 5 minus 5 answer will be the 0 in a subtraction same number means the answer will be the 0 okay
Pebbles CBSE Board Syllabus